Hello guys, today our topic about uh, Toyota Yaris or BIOS the engine crank but not start and you have DTC 40351 P0351 P0352 P0353 P0 and P0354 and then the four pieces ignition coil there is no spark okay remember guys the four pieces per uh, ignition coil is not suddenly four pieces ignition coil busted together okay I will teach you how to diagnose uh, with using this probe and uh, this circuit diagram this is the circuit diagram of Toyota Yaris 2007, 8, 9, 10. And remember also, for example, the engine crank but not start. And then your fuel pump pressure is okay. Your injector system is okay. Your computer is okay. Your uh, crankshaft sensor and camshaft sensor, everything is fine. But the issue, four pieces ignition coil not spark. Okay, guys. Guys, this is our ignition coil. Ignition, ignition coil number one, number two, number three, number four. Every coil, they have separate connector. The color code of also of the ignition coil number one is black number two is gray number three is black number four is gray okay i will teach you how to diagnose for the uh, this issue guys this is our ignition coil connector this pin four faces fin number one fin number two three and four this is number one is always ignition voltage or positive. This number number four is always ground. This number two is ignition timing, and number three is 0.5 volt feedback. Okay. This is the pin. Uh, female type. Okay. Pin number one, two, three, four. Ground. Uh, sorry, ground, and 12 volt signal. Okay, during ignition on. For, for example, guys, uh, the engine crank but not start, but the issue is the four phases ignition coil is no spark. Use at this lamp. This number one pin ignition on and uh, probe the this lamp. If the test lamp illuminate, so means you have no issue on the voltage. Again, no issue on the voltage. Check the ground. Connect your alligator of your uh, test lamp to positive and the end of your test lamp put there in the ground pin number four supposed to be your test lamp is illuminate means if the test lamp not illuminate you have uh, broken wire or lost ground okay this is our 12 volt supply if this one is no 12 volts means you have issue in uh, pios ignition switch or really or you have open circuit hello guys uh, this is our uh, circuit diagram complete circuit diagram now I introduce you how the work of this uh, ignition system ignition system control
guys this is our engine computer look this is our four pieces ignition coil this is pin number one of every ignition coil connector if you see this uh, connector all wire is spliced here number one number two number three is spliced here and then going to fuel pump sorry uh, ignition ignition to relay this the relay of the ignition coil and then we have a 2 amperes fuse uh, where you find this fuse we can find on the under hood fuse block guys when you open the fuse block under hood if you see this 15 ampere fuse this is the ignition to fuse for, for your uh, ignition coil ok guys now this is the fuse right this is always uh, steady 12 volts even your ignition switch is uh, off or your k is on ignition zero you have still 12 volts this fuse okay we will follow this circuit diagram going to your ignition relay now the, the Relay is open position still on open position so the 12 volts only this area coming to ignition switch this is ignition switch okay coming here to ignition switch pin number 5 but the position is still open so the electric 12 volts here 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 only okay now we will proceed to ignition on or cranking position when you ignition on this uh, switch will be closed position and the 12 volts coming here this area going to relay what happened now this is the ignition relay when the electric or 12 volts going here the relay will be closed position so you have now uh, 12 volts here going to this uh, ignition coil connector 1 2 3 4 connector so you have uh, 12 volts when you test at this lamp to verify this connector of the hub 12 volts use this lamp if you have 12 volt this pin number one of this four pieces uh, ignition coil connector so means you have no problem you have no problem on the uh, ignition supply or 12 volt supply so for example if you have no supply on this four pin this four fan connector of four pieces ignition coil so means you have problem in fuse fuse is busted or open okay next if your fuse is okay go to relay this relay you can find on the driver side near on the steering wheel in the on the near on the uh, panel side 
you can see the relay there uh, ignition to relay if you need this location please uh, message to me i will send you the complete location also this connector this 1b 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 this is the part of uh, fuse box okay guys so means for example you, re you replace the relay but still, still problem you have no electric this why these two pins even you are ignition on on position so for example if this area no 12 volts so you have problem on this two connector okay guys or your under under fuse block connector if you need more uh, question please uh, message to me i will respond to your uh, issue about this uh, fuse block fuse block issue if you have issue okay now for example your 12 volts is okay so you have no problem we proceed to ground this is the ground fin number four all connector is of the ignition coil is number pin number four is uh, all ground for example look the diagram if you have no uh, ground like this this alligator of this lamp or this probe put on battery positive side and then your this probe put on pin number four once you have no electric or 12 volts on the ground means you have open circuit on, on this area this area okay guys for example uh, look first look the diagram this is place coming here to number four also uh, pin number four also this one pin number four ground okay also pin number four if the issue is from here this area so means you have no ground on this for ignition coil connector for example if you have no ground you can uh, rem disconnect the connector and can you can foot the or splice this area for this ground and tap any engine ground or you can look at this uh, bolt on rear side of the rear cylinder head you have 10 um, millimeter bolt there or the wire is broken okay guys uh, again guys this is the connector of your ignition coil this is pin number one pin number two three and four where the last step issue is the ground this is the ground you can uh, for example this is, uh, if you have no ground you can uh, open this wire for example open this wire and uh, you can tap from the ground guys this is uh, only example this is only example huh? for example this is, uh, this red uh, forget that one if supposed to be is black so what you do open this wire and you can tap a wire and put on the engine ground and your issue is solved your concern is solved and guys don't be afraid even you put a ground on this area is cannot be fake your engine computer because this ground is uh, not reference ground not supplied by computer this is the uh, engine 
ground so no problem when you can tap this wire for make extra ground extra ground to run only your engine you can put okay guys um, if you have more uh, question please message to me I will uh, answer your question and okay guys I hope you understand my English and then please subscribe my channel and thank you very much and God bless thank you